How we doing, Nation? John here. Uh, first and foremost, thank you for the support outside of the main YouTube channel, uh, here on the Extras channel, and the thumbs up and the subscribes and all that stuff. I appreciate it. Just a couple of quick things. Hopefully you can hear me. It's kind of windy out here. It's been raining all day. Uh, first of all, not affiliated whatsoever. I'm going to be doing a gear review. I'm going to try and film it sometime this week. There's really no rush. Uh, again, I'm not working with this company or anything. Crate Club. I was doing a Battle Box video. I don't think it was the most recent. I think it was the one before. And somebody had mentioned Crate Club. I'd never heard of them. Uh, I considered it because they're kind of expensive. So I've been pondering it for a while. And I broke down and took the plunge. They only send out a box, I think, every three months. And so I'm going to break down one on camera. But I'm, I'm going to spice it up a little bit. I'm going to try and get Caveman James involved. I'm going to see if we can go somewhere beyond the Ponderosa. Maybe go Bigfoot hunting or something like that and try the gear out in real time. Whatever Crate Club happens to send. And, you know, there, there's going to be no discount code or anything like that. It's going to be for the gearheads just to let you know, give you a heads up. What I was talking about this morning with the new content, we were getting into yard sales and stuff. So I got the email. Uh, the guy sent over the email. He's like, you need to remind folks the yard sales are a great place. And they are. We talked about it this morning. There are a lot of flea markets in Mount Airy in Surrey County. It's kind of a big deal. Now, some people call these like swap meets and stuff. I guess it depends on where you live. Here, they're called flea markets. And so I, really, I started to think about this. And I said, you know, it's flea market season, yard sale season. Would you folks be interested if I were just to slap on the, you know, the either use this camera or the GoPro or something and just go out to these flea markets in search of prepping stuff? Um, now, obviously, in the winter, the flea markets, they're empty. Nobody's there. So I would have to go, you know, Lowe's, Rule King and stuff like this, which has been done in the prepping community. But I don't know. At least I've never seen anybody go to a flea market. Here in the prepping community so if that's something y'all would be interested in and if you think the folks over on the main channel would actually stay there for more than five seconds uh let me know in the comments i would really appreciate it because it's something that again i'm surrounded by flea markets and i don't know why this didn't hit me we can do flea market madness videos every so often or something um you know maybe they come up total bust and i find nothing but maybe we stumble across 50 cent duct tape or something. You know what I'm, I'm getting at. And we'll do some yard sales and things too. But um, I've been thinking about doing that ever since I got the email the other day. And I was also thinking, you know, Caveman, um, Jack, the Outlaw Prepper, the original Outlaw Prepper. And we're also considering bringing, you know, one of those or even both of those guys along when we do the flea marketing stuff. Who knows? And there are more than two outlaw preppers. And eventually, I want to get some more of those guys involved over on the other channel. Uh, probably the next one you're going to be introduced to is Linville. He's a really cool dude. We call him Linville or Lynn. But uh, he metal detects and stuff like that. So I don't know. It's kind of their whole deal over there. They hardly ever update their YouTube page. But I will say that they have a cool t-shirt. Caveman is working on a cool t-shirt over there. Uh, so eventually you're going to see some new content over there, but I'm focused on Prepper Nation, right? So I just wanted to let y'all know about the gear review that's going to be coming up. Uh, for those that don't know, I ain't plugging it or anything. Crate Club, what drew me to the comment that I got about Crate Club is I think it's, I believe it's an ex-Navy SEAL that started the company and there's supposed to be no junk in the boxes. So we're going to put that to the test, son, like the... The Spartan said about the Immortals on 300. We're going to put it to the test. And maybe it's a complete bust. I don't know. Let me know about the flea marketing and stuff like that. Uh, and if you have any other ideas for content over on the main channel, I'm all ears. Uh, but I got to run right now. I got to go make some notes for tomorrow's video. Uh, so until next time, till tomorrow morning, y'all take care and God bless.